guys. Uh, I have not finished uploading <laughs> the last five videos. Um, I'll do that tonight, but uh, figured I'd play while it's not too late to be making noise. Um, yeah. I was just thinking to myself, too, it's like, why do I even have the TV on when I'm recording this on my laptop and I'm looking at my laptop screen, but then I remembered that the sound is coming through the TV because I couldn't figure out how to get it to come through my Dazzle device into OBS. Uh, okay, so where were we? We were leveling Squirtle and then heading on our way. So yeah, let's, oh, and we have our bike so we can go fast. Yay. Okay. Do, 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 do. And we gotta go down before we can go right. I don't even know what route this is. What does this say? Route 12. Okay. Yeah, I still don't think I'm supposed to... There's a lot on that side. Alright, I think because of the Snorlax. Because I think... I think I'm supposed to go north and then east, because we went up here, and then we came down here, right? And then we hit the SSN, and then all of a sudden it shows up up there, but maybe it's because we have to go through the Diglett Cave to get up there? So, yeah. But in the meantime, I think I'm still going to continue on over here, because I was battling all these guys, right? Uh, who hadn't I battled yet? I battled this kid. I could just talk to him instead of going in front of him, but... And I battled that guy. But not this guy! Alright, I think this is another gambler, so... We should be in good shape. His outfit's so funky, man. He looks a little bit better in the red version, actually. I wonder how they decided, like, what that button did and, like, what tone it would change color-wise. I wonder what other games, uh, what it does to other games, too. I'd be interested. I have a lot of other Game Boy Color games. Still not, still not strong enough yet. Uh, yeah, so we'll just, we'll just keep swapping out. Um, yeah, I've got a lot of other Game Boy games besides the Pokemon game. Ah, Sleep Powder. Dang it. That's no bueno. Um. <laughs> but, uh, always oh, storing energy. Um. Yeah, so I wonder, I wonder, like, if I plug those in, like, what the controls would be. You know, because they got to translate from the Game Boy controller to the Super Nintendo controller, which it's not that much different, honestly. I mean, there's a, a few less buttons, but that's about it, right? Um. Yeah, but yeah, I wonder. I wonder what all the buttons do. And that button I was pushing to do this is different from the button that I push. Okay, Y is either the same as B or the same as A. Let's see. All right, Y is the same as B, and the upper right and left buttons do nothing. Okay. I guess I never fully uh, tested that out. I tell you one one time I uh, I looked so on on the either the back or the bottom of my Super Nintendo they've got a you know a number to call and if you have problems and stuff and of course you know I, we got this machine in I think ninety one was brand spanking new and uh, I, I so I was like yeah there's no way this number still works right well. Actually, it does. It goes to the current Nintendo support line, uh, which I thought was pretty cool that they kept that phone number all this time. And, uh, oh, that did not do anything. Oh, that was ridiculous. All right. What about, I think this is Body Slam, maybe? Yeah, that's better. Okay. Ugh. And he poisoned me. Poor Pikachu is poisoned. Oh, and of course that means as I move, Pikachu's gonna get hurt by poison until he eventually faints. 
But at this point, I'm not so worried about keeping him from painting. Uh, to, you know. Uh, yeah. Alright. Yep, we'll put Squirtle back in there. But yeah, they kept that number all these years. And, uh, and it still feeds into their current... I don't know what their... I, I don't know what their current support line number is. If it is the exact same number, or if this number just forwards into it, maybe. Um, I should have thrown out. Oh, I don't have a bird Pokemon in my in my party anymore because I, I threw them out so I could bring the Squirtle in. Um, but uh, yeah, it was just funny to me. You know what? I'm gonna. Ah, it doesn't work on him. Oh, but he can use Absorb on me. That's not fair. Yeah, at least it didn't do much. Alright, we'll use Tackle instead. Oh, no, wait, let's use Cut. I don't know why I'm not thinking about using Cut. It didn't do much anyways. Let's see what Tackle does. Maybe it's just because he's a Grass Pokemon, too. Yeah, about the same. Yeah, so maybe they just forwarded the number? I don't know. But I thought it was pretty... Uh pretty funny that I could do that. I should inspect the rest of this stuff. My uh, controller here says Super NES controller model number SNS-005 RD 1991. Okay. Nintendo made in Japan. I should look at my other controllers. Um, so I've, I've got the original two controllers that came with the machine. Uh, and then I uh, one of them is getting kind of frayed at the end because, I mean, I know you're not supposed to, but we all do it, roll up the cord around the controller. And so it was getting kind of frayed. And uh just realized my machine was on mute again. But we learned that doesn't matter for recording, uh, only for output. Uh, anyways, uh, so it was getting kind of frayed at the end. I still use it. Um... Or I still have it. I use the unfrayed original controller, but I have the frayed one too in case I play two player or something. I don't know. Um, but I was like, you know, in case that one goes out, I don't want to be left in the cold. And the local game shop that is awesome, by the way, um, it uh, they had uh, both original and reproduction controllers for sale. Um, I bought an original. I, I know there's probably no difference, but... Yay! What we learn? Easy day pull. Something with water. Um, I'm gonna have to write that down. Um, yeah. So I, I, yeah, I totally lost my train of thought, <laughs> thought there. Uh, that means I'm too tired and I should just stop talking. <laughs> And poor Pikachu's totally going to faint because he's poisoned. Alright, let's see what this move is. Alright. Mizu de po. And let's see, Squirtle. What does he learn at level 15? Is number seven in the Pokedex. All right, water gun. Okay. <laughs> Depo means <laughs> gun, apparently. All right, so water gun. Let's see. It does. Uh, oh. Okay. I guess it can also be learned via something else. Okay. 40 damage, 100% of the time. Alright. Good to know. So for him, it's 100% of the time. Does 40 damage. Uh, so a little bit better than Tackle. And twice as powerful as just our little bubble. So he's leveling up. That's good. I don't think I should go very far. Eesh, poor Pikachu. Here, let's battle this guy. Did I talk to that other guy after I got done battling him? If not, I'll have to talk to him after this. It's 
It's funny that they black him out, even though he's perfectly fine. You know what? I wonder if I should just go ahead with this. Okay, I'm gonna move that up there. And that there. And let's use Water Gun. He should have a type advantage here. Oh, but he's too weak to take on a higher level yet. Yeah, nope. Not gonna happen. Pikachu, you're up. No more favoritism. <laughs> I feel bad. I, I used him. I used him to get free Pokemon. And then I'm just treating him like all my other Pokemon. There we go. It's probably the last uh, time Pikachu is going to be good in battle. Koeru, no wait. Dokkon, Dokkon. I don't know if I know this guy. You know what, Let, let's keep Pikachu in here for now. Oh, Vulpix, okay. Dokkon is Vulpix, got it. Uh, Pikachu is probably going to faint anyway, so I might as well just do what damage I can while he's still awake. And we'll do a quick attack too. So no, I'm not going to get another hit in if I wait. Hurt by poison and... Oh, he didn't faint yet. But now he will. I wish I could... Oh, that's such a terrible noise. Why'd they make it so sad when he faints? Nobody else sounds that sad. Ugh. Okay. Well, I mean, if uh, Squirtle was up to the task... I'd throw him in there, but he's just not strong enough yet to battle someone that level, so... Uh... Let's, let's throw Mankey in there. Oh, that just breaks my heart. The sound of Pikachu fainting. Ta-da! Alright. And we'll talk to this guy. And then... Let's talk to this guy too, because I can't remember if I talked to him. You guys will probably notice a theme here. I often forget if I did stuff. Ooh, a utility worker. Oh no, an electrician? Or no, Denkia no Oyanchi. So yeah, I guess electric utility worker. Or uh, he's either an electrician or an electric utility worker. One of the two. Oh, we do not want this matchup. Let's throw in Geodude. I guess I, I should just go by type rather than trying to run through each of the Pokemon individually. Oof, that Sonic Boom really does do a number. So much for being a Rock type against an Electric type. I guess when you know, uh... When you know something works, something works. Except for then he switched over to using Tackle when he knew Sonic Boom was doing the job. Like, I don't I don't understand. Unless he's trying to conserve the number of times he can use Sonic Boom. But, I don't know. Sometimes I feel like... And I know I'm going past with the text there. Sometimes I feel like the game is... I don't know if rigged is the right word, because rigged implies that it's stacked against you. But I feel like sometimes they make it easier for the player. I don't know if that if that makes sense to you guys or not, but like they make the computer players don't make good choices. And it feels like computer players should always make good choices. And maybe they did that to make it more realistic, but like it feels like a very obvious thing. I don't know. <clears throat> Are 
are you out here working or are you out here battling? I am going to go in the grass, but I want to battle all these guys first. Alright, well we learned our lesson with Geodude. He didn't, uh, didn't really stand a chance. We'll just throw Mankey in here, I guess. I know it's karate, not karate. I don't know. I guess when you grow up with something ingrained in you, it's hard to change your pronunciation even after you learn the right way to say it. And I've known for years the right way to say it, but yet, I don't know. I guess I need to make more of a conscious effort. Yay! He's getting up there quickly. Alright, one more. Two more. Yep. Let's throw Squirtle back in. And then our first move will be to swap them back out. It is an exhausting way to level, but right now I don't really have any other choice since I don't have XP experience all. <coughs> but that's gonna, like... You know, that also takes time to level. But I th I feel like it takes time to level, but it doesn't take as much time to level. Uh, because you're not wasting moves swapping Pokemon in and out. So it's slightly more advantageous. <sighs> oh, alright. Uh, so, Koyuru is Magnemite, so... This guy is Magneton. Yep. Bea. I wonder what Bea means. There. Back. Anybody getting dizzy yet? All this flip flopping back and forth. Oof. Yeah, that sonic boom really is a doozy. I don't know why I hold down A after I've. Uh, initiated the move. Like, it's not going to make any difference. Right. And we had learned some more moves, I thought. What was this one? Was this anything good? I don't remember now. Oh, double team or something like it. Yeah, I don't care about that. Oh, and that's right. Fire didn't do much against these guys. Uh, I guess neither does Scratch. Let's go back to fire then. Dang. Okay. Level 17, yes! At least it's, it's not as slow to level them as it was to level some of these other guys earlier on. <clears throat> We've got more uh, trainers we can battle here. <gasps> yeah! Squirtle's evolving! So sweet! Alright. War Turtle! Alright, so his new name... Ah, uh, disappeared way too quickly. <sighs> Talk to this guy. Alright, let's see... Alright, so before he was Zenigame, and now he is Kameru. Kameru. Alright, well, I, okay, I don't know what the Odu added on there is, but that's fine. Uh, War Turtle. Yeah, next stop, Blastoise. Sweet. Alright. And only 625 uh, points to go until he gets to the next level. Sweet. Oh. We are doing a little poorly here. So I think what I'm going to do, I'll go back to the Poké Center and um, heal up. 
and then we'll start a new video. Yeah, let's let's do a little bit in the grass, just to see if we see anything. I mean, worse comes to worse, we uh, don't uh, we don't find anything. But who else do I have? I feel like fire should be really effective against birds, too. I mean, it is in real life. Like, wildfires are completely devastating. And not just wildfires, forest fires, you know, man started fires. Yeah, I'm just gonna go heal up. Then we can do the last couple of uh, battles with the trainers, find the sleeping Snorlax, uh, probably roam around in the grass a little bit, uh, see if we find any new Pokemon. Be great if there were ABBA in this grass. I, I kind of think maybe... I can't remember where all the ABBA show up. So, do we need to rearrange? We do need to do a little bit of rearranging. Okie dokie. So, we'll, we'll save and end here in about 22 minutes, so that's, that's good. And, uh, yeah, then I'll catch you guys next time. Alright, take it easy.